establishing shot of my bike. <clears throat> this is a little panorama of the dog park. You can see it is a very nice dog park. Some of the rules, uh, three dog limit per person. Dog owners must have a leash for each dog. Dog owners must clean up feces deposited by their dogs. Uh, actually, I think those are good rules for life, the relation between the sexes. It's kind of cold out here. I forgot to call Pat. I got a little confused about what the protocol was. And I called him a little late. And here we have the new bike lovingly attached to the new bike carrier. You can see how the bike carrier attaches. Hooks there. Then hooks again at the bottom. This bike carrier was purchased because I thought it could come on and off easily. But as it turns out, you have to go to a great deal of trouble to attach those uh, those latches. Which bikes are expensive. So we subsidize it partly by accepting money from this most dangerous game dog park. Uh, when Pat and I start riding, they'll give us a three minute head start. And then they'll let loose the dogs. And if they catch us, well, there is a bonus. Now tell, tell the audience what we're up to today, Pat. We are going to be uh, biking to Novato and back <laughs> in uh, 55 minutes or less. Okay, here we are. There's Pat up there. And here I am riding along trying not to fall off the Fargan bike. And doing a good job. Yes, yeah, so here, here I am. So can I do this with one hand? Uh, can I ride with one hand? So far, so good. And then there's Pat over there. Here we are. Coming around the curve into, I guess, the main what you'd call the main marina. I guess you'd call it that. I'm now biking with my, guiding with my right hand, which is more powerful. And there you go, you see, the heart de marina. Once again, Pat leads the way. Okay, here we are, approaching the the heart of the Inner Harbor? I have no idea. don't want to be too melodramatic. There's a couple of restaurants over there. I stopped on certain celebratory occasions. You can see that this is a, the, the non-gritty part of Richmond, I guess you'd say. Did you tell me that there's sort of just a one road access to here from the rest of Richmond? Yeah. Okay. It's kind of a sneaky wind. Here we are, riding along over rough planks. It is not unmanly to do so. I am going to fall off this darn bike taking pictures. I know it. What are we looking at? Oh, look at that. What in the world is that? Looks old, eh? Beautiful, sleek boat out there. We don't know what the story is. We aren't quite sure what this is. This is industrial buildings. I'm not sure what. Probably be fun to bike at night. I wonder if they do much night biking here. Okay, Big Daddy. In the distance, you know, there'll be some great views of it. 
weren't so foggy. Say that's a beautiful old building. Ah. The boiler house, it says. The boiler house restaurant? What is this? The boiler house restaurant? Is this, uh, is this still shooting? Yeah, it is. So here we go, right along next to. Lovely old building, and who here on the right? This is at some period of time a once in the future ferry landing. I'm not sure. So, uh, if we stop, we'll never get going. out there people of the houses as we come back from the heart of Richmond Marina. There the houses are. Oh, got that? Okay. And there is a bit of wind, but makes it better sport. All is not downhill, at least we hope, with the wind at our back. And, oh, there's where we've been. You, see, you might see the boiler house in the distance. We've been all the way around there. Oh, that was a little quick. downhill here. This path leading the way. And here we are coming up on the the run along the sloughs or the moors of the water. Uh, a nice long straightaway. In the distance. The towers of Emeryville. Okay. Now let's get on that straightaway people. Here we are. See that straight away? Oh yeah, this is drop the hammer down. Very my head. Really gets a little bit. We what we're probably going eight or ten miles an hour. Six Heavy five. And there's Pat checking out his. Uh, the best day of the day is putting the squad. Taking a run. So we've been writing for now. Okay. Character study in pain. This is the only difference between me and La Lance Armstrong is, well, one testicle, of course. But. Mere geography, Pat says. Mere geography. That's all. Oh, it's still going. Okay, this is 
coming up on the end of the trail. We're coming back to the dog park. And the end of the trail. You can see doggies over there. Uh, doggies coming across the doggy bridge. And a biker hurtling toward me into the parking lot. All right. And here we are. Threading the needle. Ignoring the stop sign. And back. 